Hello and welcome to your July 2022 general reading with myself, Thomas Janak. You're watching Thomas' Tower page. Please like, subscribe and share. And if you like my work, you can now buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. I have a guest today, Charlie Evans. Welcome. Hello. And um, so, like I said, this is a general reading. What we do here, we divide the areas slightly so you get more out of it and what we will do is we will look at the overall energy for the month of july for the sign of aries and then we will look into the overall uh, sorry into the um, uh, emotional core see what what comes in maybe there's healing that has to happen or maybe there's love coming in don't know yet because i only work here and the guides only tell me when it is my turn so to speak and then we will look at the opportunities as to present themselves to you in the month of july 2022 now remember this is the month of Cancer, so Cancerian months, um, and so the, the energy that Cancerian has, Cancer has, is around us all. Now, what is interesting about this is that Cancer is governed by the Moon. It's the only sign that is governed by the Moon, and then from there we're going into Leo on the twenty-third of July, which is governed by the Sun. While that doesn't sound much. The sun and the moon, while they're oftentimes close, they do not share space well. And so there is um, overlapping energy points where, when they orbit each other, where um, lunar eclipses can happen and solar eclipses can happen. The point is that they're not the most compatible energies. And because we're dealing with these two opposites in the month of July, there's a good chance that whether or not this comes up in the overall energy or not, this will be a bit of a month where a lot of us will probably have strong opinions and they can go from one, um, one, from one extreme to the next. Blame it on the energy, because literally that's what happens when you have cancer uh, energy going into, into Leo. But because we're going into Leo on the July, on July the 23rd, very likely the energy will not be super bad or super fictitious. But pay attention around the time when we're changing from Cancerians to, to, uh, to Leo. Anyway, speaking of star signs, this is the overall energy for the month of July 2022 for the sign of Aries. So the card we've got is Mary Magdalene, so teacher awakes. So the reading on the card says, you have something important to share, follow the inner call. Don't let anything stop you. So this is your month, Aries. Don't let anything hold you back. If you've got something niggling away, make sure that you take that with pride, that thing that you've got to share. Make sure that you share it with, with, with the ones you love. Make sure that if you are in a leadership position that you're showing your strengths, showing what you really can do. Let your potential unleash this month. Okay, thank you so much. And then when it comes to your emotional core, you have very interesting topics here or, or, or energies here because you have reclamation and truth. So Aries is a star sign that by default has some issues actually reaching out because you're the first star sign. So normally there's nobody else that you can ask for help. So sometimes Aries by default have issues actually reaching out. But when it comes to reclamation, which isn't about reaching out, it's about getting whatever it is you give to others because Aries is a very giving sign and oftentimes you're just pissed off because nobody ever repays it yeah but that's because you're not asking for it <laughs> so when it has when it comes to reclamation what the guides are asking you in the month of July 2022 is to not just reclaim but also show people that you have boundaries. Really, really important to understand that. If you're constantly giving, people get used to it. That doesn't make them bad people, it makes them opportunists, right? And sometimes people need to be told when enough is enough. Um, and because you have truth as the outgoing energy, this will show you, sounds a bit harsh, not meant that way, but this will show you who your true friends are, if that makes sense, and who you can trust and all that kind of stuff. Interestingly enough, because this is your emotional core, I'm at getting fake all about whether or not there's love coming in or whether or not there's actually healing happening for Aries. What this means is that in order for you to get what you deserve, which is about your emotions, is about paying attention to 
Who is giving you what you give them? Where are you in the scheme of things? And when you then reclaim your space, just remember that a lot of people have no idea that they're not giving you what you give them because you never asked for it. Okay? That was the um, that was the emotional core for the month of July 2022 for the sign of Aries. Now, lastly, we go into the opportunities um, as to present themselves to you in the month of July 2022. Uh, yeah, so brilliant. I just want to add on your uh, emotional core. I also got self worth, so that's yeah. really important. Make sure that you're getting out, uh, giving out what you're getting back as well. Um, so your opportunities for the month is the cheetah. So this is about focusing and setting your intentions and going for it. So in terms of money, make sure that you're working towards a goal, that you're not overly spending, that you're focusing on what you really need to focus on, uh, whether that's bills, whether that's an exciting holiday that you really need. So make sure that you focus and budget appropriately so you can get the goals and get the intentions that you need to get the right energy for you. Okay, thank you very much. And you heard it here first. If you if you blow all your money, don't blame us, right? <laughs> you okay. <didn't> listen. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. So, um, Aries, thank you so much. Please share this widely. People always say to me like, "Oh, I don't know to whom I share it because most of my friends aren't Aries." I don't give a shit. <laughs> we want this shared. This is a free service, right? So, and who knows if it affected you or it meant something to you? You don't know who 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 it can reach. Please, please, please like, subscribe, and share. It helps us grow the channel. So don't give me these stories. Everybody just texts me. Oh yeah, I don't know how to do it. Right? I don't care. Please, please, please share. <laughs> All right then. See you next month. Bye bye.